Sun, a few weeks ago, you saw me reveal the Mosa Aircross, a big professional camera gimbal. Well, it's pretty cool, but a bit too big for me to handle. So I contacted Mosa Gusson, and they agreed to send me something smaller and easier to handle, the Mosa Mini Me. Now, before I unpack it and show it off, I want to explain a little bit about how I choose equipment. I choose the gear that's most easy to use. Part of it is I rather spend time making things than fussing about with settings. But for things like the gimbal, often I need to be able to just hand it to whomever is at the location and ask them to shoot for me. So everything I shoot with needs to be very easy for first timers to use, but still provide good results. Now let's unpack it. Case looks really nice. There are foams inside. So during the shipping, it won't, I, I think it protects it from shipping. Now let's slide it out. There is a tripod here. So at the bottom, there is a hole. And let's put the screw the tripod in. And then let's stand it up. The app is called Mosa Genie. You can download it in Google Store or maybe their official, official website. Bluetooth not open, open it first. Yeah, I have got to open, uh, turn on the Bluetooth first. Make sure your Bluetooth is on and it's finding the Moza device and connect it. So you just click it, hit it once and now it's connecting. I'm pretty sure I downloaded the latest version. If you want to update your firmware, on here, you can see there is a camera icon in the center. You just press the camera icon and the power button at the same time. And then you uh, open your app. And the first thing it pops up, it will be there is a latest uh, firmware. Do you want to update? And then just update it. My friend Tanya from Pimeroni is in town. Pimeroni is a supplier of electronic parts based in the UK. But lots of countries carry their products. They're really nice people and I'm going to put their link in the description box. Right now, Tanya and I are going to visit the Creality 3D Printer Factory. It's in Longkwa. Um, it's about 30 minutes away. Let's give the camera a test drive. Oh dear, the old girls, the yeah. boys doing the production line. This is their production oh. line. I think we have um, nearly all girls doing our production line. We have one, one man. This, this is uh, Ender Free uh, power supply. This is so on the side they have 115 volt and 230 volt. So you just uh, click the button and you switch to the other. So you can use it in either country. Yeah, in either country. Depends on your uh, region. Okay. 
this is the aluminum plate. They put the LCD inside the aluminum plate. And all the screws. They're using their uh, motherboard to test out the LCD panel. This is the one they are going to connect it with the LCD panel. And I did it in the video. Ready? <笑>我全都是那空气吧再一次我就问你我就把那个全部的工具放打开臭不就扔了我就不知道那个怎么读然后我就说他们是不是写错了然后啊这是我自己搜错了然后我就把那个然后我们在这边组装的时候找了半天
Now they fix the English accent. Oh, okay. 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 好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,好,